Well, before you fire up the stove for breakfast this morning, you'll need to watch this next report. Some health advocates are sounding an alarm about gas stoves. As Channel 9 Scott Wickersham explains, if your stove operates on gas, there's something you need to do before you turn it on. When Matt Casal moved into his new home last year, the first thing he did was replace the gas stove with an electric one. He's an environmental advocate with the consumer watchdog U.S. Purge and says there are hidden dangers from gas stoves. It's not commonly known how significant of a problem it could be. He points to a number of studies that say cooking with gas, even for a short period of time, can create unhealthy levels of toxic gases. In reality, every time you turn on the stove, it's releasing these pollutants into your home. But there's nothing, you know, on the stove that would tell you that. According to the New England Journal of Medicine, gas stoves increase the risk for asthma and exacerbate COPD and cardiovascular disease. The National Environmental Health Association says gas stoves release combustion-generated nitrogen dioxide and other pollutants, which it says are associated with increased risk and severity of childhood asthma. In 2017, the Massachusetts Department of Public Health said gas used for cooking was the number one cause of childhood asthma, even more so than pets in the home. Safety advocates and most cooks will tell you that if you're cooking with a gas stove, proper ventilation is the key. And the best way to do that is with a system like this that will suck the gas up and out of your home. If their ventilation system really does not ventilate outside, I would make an investment to make that happen. Dr. Britta Lundberg leads a patient advocacy group and says everyone should use their fan when they cook, even if they think it's too loud or annoying. My worry is that it does bother people, right? And most of us don't use that fan. Using ventilation is 100% necessary. Saba Duffy takes it a step further. She says not only should you use that fan every time you cook, you should turn it on before you start cooking to get the air flowing before the gas does. If you're using gas and you're going to be searing or doing any high temperature cooking, there's going to be a lot of grease, a lot of splatter, and a lot of gas emissions. So you do have to have that hood on to get the air out. Well, if you don't feel like you're getting proper ventilation for your gas stove, you could look into an electric induction oven. They're more expensive, but safety experts say they're more efficient and they're safer in your home. Back to you. Well, if you have a gas stove, it's highly recommended that you have a range hood. But if that's not an option, you can open some windows while you cook to create a draft and increase airflow. And if you have a window fan, run it on exhaust when you cook. And you can uh, buy an air purifier with a carbon filter to remove some of those par particulates from the air.